A new talking point is showing up more often in attack ads and in quotes from politicians. It has to do with a ban on gas stoves. Republicans say one Democratic congressman from the Triangle wants one, and tonight CBS 17's Jody McCrary is fact-checking that claim. That's the claim the GOP committee is making against Democratic Congressman Wiley Nickel. They point to one of his votes as proof. But when I look closer, I found a ban is not exactly what he was voting on. The idea of a ban on gas stoves has sparked a debate between Republicans and Democratic Congressman Wiley Nickel. National Republican Congressional Committee Regional Spokeswoman Delaney Bomar said in a statement that Nickel backed a ban on gas stoves. Nickel's response was simple, saying, no, I do not support a ban on gas stoves. The issue stems from a proposal from the U.S. Department of Energy and a vote in Congress. Energy officials want the gas stoves you buy in stores to be more efficient. So under their plan, starting in four years, manufacturers could not sell stoves that burn more than 1.2 million BTUs a year. That's about half of the models currently in use. But the key word is manufacturers. It would not affect the stove you have now. And here's how nickel factors in. An amendment to the Republicans' energy bill blocks those rules from being put into place and stops the department from ever putting in new regulations in the future. Nickel voted no, but both the amendment and the bill passed anyway. The bill now goes to the Senate, and I break down what could happen to it next in my story online. Jody McCrary, CBS 17 News.